Today at Hinkley Point C, we're with Rob Bragg, a radiography coordinator, and we're going to be asking him all about radiography and what his team does. Rob, what is radiography? Yeah, radiography is pretty much like going to a hospital and getting an x-ray, but we're doing this on an industrial level. So we're radiographing or x-raying uh, pipe welds or plate welds um, that are for systems that are going to be going into the uh, power station that we're building. Why is quality so important at Hinkley Point C? Well, we're building a nuclear power station here at Hinkley Point C, um, and that demands the highest quality of welding. Uh, and so we need to measure that quality by using radiography and, you know, and just to ensure that high standards and defect free uh, components are being made. What's it like working here at Hinkley Point C? Oh, it's brilliant. I can't believe the scale of the place. It's a great project, it's great people. And um, yeah, I just want to stay here till the last radiograph's done. And are you part of the big team? Uh, yeah, so yeah, I've got my team of um, radiation protection technicians. Uh, uh, we work under our rad protection manager and we also support the radiography as it goes ahead. What would you suggest to a young person to study if they wanted to be involved in radiography? Uh, Defo helps to have um, you know, appreciation of maths, English and science. So, should we go into the West Bunker and take a look at what's going on? Yeah, see if we can find a radiographer, shall we? Hey guys, how are you doing? Sorry to interrupt. Can you explain, uh, Nigel, Ian, what you're up to? Yeah, we're doing uh, non-destructive testing, radiography. Uh, and what we're actually doing is positioning the film upon this seam weld here to take a shot of this particular location. And what we're looking for is uh, internal flaws. It's basically the same as taking a photograph. We've got to make sure this is fixed in position, a good, still uh, solid location. Same with the head that's taking the shot itself. That's got to be in a solid location from a source of film distance of just over a metre. And uh, there'll be an exposure time given to it to get an image upon the film. And then from this, we will then take it to the dark room, process it, and then we'll see what the image shows. And if there's anything wrong with it, we'll actually mark down the repair area. The lads will come, they'll repair it, we'll come back, test it, all clear, move on to the next one. Brilliant. And why is non-destructive testing so important here at Hinkley Point C? They're wanting to save this. This is a part of a, a ceiling plate, so it's got to be uh, leak tight. So we've got, we'll be checking to make sure there's no flaws in it. And if you do destructive testing, it'll just destroy it. This is part of non-destructive testing. It means that the item itself won't be harmed in any way and it'll be fit for purpose once ready. What type of skills are really important as a radiographer? Identification, location. These are key factors in the setup of the process. All this has to be positioned in a very accurately so that if there is a repair, they come back, they can find exactly the location that's needed to be able to repair this properly. If the information's in the wrong place or it's out of place, then they could be breaking or cutting into a good part of the world when they should be taking out the bad part. Right, thank you for explaining. It's been fascinating to learn more about non-destructive testing and radiography here at Hinkley Point C with Rob and Nigel. If you want to find out more about the world of Hinkley Point C, Young HBC and our jobs and opportunities, just make sure you click on the links below. Mm -hmm.